Hello and welcome to today's walk. Today we are in Baldwin Park, California at the corner of Garvey Avenue and Francisquito Avenue alongside the I-10 freeway. And as you can see behind me, we are at the replica of the original In-N-Out Burger. So, join us as we walk In-N-Out. Let's go. So as I was saying, this is uh, Francisquito Avenue in Garvey, and that's the I-10 freeway. And this museum is open uh, from 11 to 2. I, I'll show the sign that shows the uh, actual uh, days and times. But if you look at this, this is how the original In-N-Out Burger basically was you know here's the two-way speaker the drive-through to go in and out but look at the prices guys 25 cents for a burger cheeseburger 30 15 cent fries and a ten dollar drink i mean wow that's awesome there's the old sign they even have somebody here that's uh that's that's here in the little museum but the two-way speaker and then the big big thing back then i guess was the order without leaving your car for your convenience so they have that cigarette machine out there oh wow <laughs> and then look at this back yo you could tell this is a long time ago wow they also sold cigarettes one cent get the camel lucky strikes wow oh this is 20 cents up here so. so yeah maybe it was single cigarettes for a penny or something maybe but yeah wow you, you pick up a burger and your cigarettes wow <laughs> so We'll go check it out inside, but yeah, this is a uh, this is pretty cool. Definitely aren't the same prices that it is that you know that it, that originally was, but look at those prices. All right, let's go take a walk around the back. So as we go around the back here, they have the old Coca-Cola crates. And I think, I don't know what this is, a dishwasher or? No, it's a washing machine. Just a washing machine for what? Well, I guess they're whites that they wear. Towels and the stuff. The towels, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's an old, old washing machine. But look at how tiny, I mean, look at, I mean, how many people actually worked inside? Here's the restroom inside here. I don't know if you guys can see because of the glare and stuff. But yeah, it's a small, tiny little restroom. But here's here's the Coke machines that they had. Or not even Coke machines, just a freezer. Or the you know the to keep the Cokes cold. And here's all the uh the drinks they, they had, the, the old time old time pepsis seven up yeah little coke bottles but these are the old old time soda pops that they had back in the back in the original opening and they have coffee in there we'll go inside right now there's some other people in there but we'll definitely go inside so let's take a walk into Back to the future, I guess. <laughs> or back to the past. Taking a step back in time. Yeah. <laughs> so 
so we're inside the actual, well, the replica of the original in and out And this is very, very tiny, but as you can see, they get a lot of work done in here. It's <laughs> such small space. So here we are with Lydia who's going to show us a little history. Yeah, so I'm wearing a white apron because they wore white aprons back then. And this is in and out before the freeway was built. It was actually on the opposite side of the street. This is Francis Guido. Now we replicated the building that looked just like this. See a resemblance? It's a 10 by 10 building. Wow. So fries, burgers, the board or a salad table where we built the burger here. There's Harry and Esther Snyder. They had two children. It's uh, Guy and Rich. And then uh, now uh, it's owned by Lindsay, their granddaughter, which is Guy's granddaughter. Uh, Guy's daughter. Uh -huh. Here's a guy right here. Can you tell by the way he's holding his mouth? It's kind of funny, huh? <laughs> That's why. <laughs> oh. <laughs> because you could in those days. Well, yeah, you can see as, 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 you, as you drive through the drive through yes. on the other side. Yes. You can see the cigarette machine. That was just a, another way to make it extra, extra bucks. There was before we actually built on the land. And then, of course, there's another photo of in and out Here's a picture of Harry. And then the sun's grown up. Oh, wow. So that's the two little boys over yeah. here. And then the two little boys right there as well. You guys know there's the cross palm trees, right? Yes. The cross palm trees come from a movie called It's mad, a Mad, 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 mad world. world. Yeah. And you can see the treasure that they were looking for in the movie was right underneath the X. But they couldn't see it. They couldn't see the forest for the trees is what I'm always saying. But there's a big W. Um, but every kid can tell you X marks the spot. Yeah. Don't forget that. So, magic. so yeah. is there a secret that there is some hidden treasure there, or is it it's hidden treasure? It's not hidden. It's for all of us to see, which is in and out. Yeah. Harry loved the movie so much that X marks the spot, in and out is the treasure. Yes. So we don't want to hide it from you. Exactly. <laughs> Hence the big sign. Um, a really cool shot out there, you guys, is the in and out sign. Uh, the original in and out sign. It's in and out hamburgers, no delay. So if you go outside at the end of the drive over there, you can see all three signs. If the one above this canopy represents yeah. 1948, then when we built on this side, we built exactly right here at this location, a two lane, and the clock sign stands here since 1954. And that's outside. Yeah, and I'll, I'll take, oh, there it is. Yeah. yeah so that's, that's been sitting here since Something wow. like a little cash drawer would have been just a nightstand. A nightstand is the cash drawer. <laughs> and a an notepad for your... Yes, just to your, take the orders. Yeah. Uh, the two-way speaker, he invented the very next year, which would have been 1949. He would already have a line and thought, man, i got to get that those orders. There's got to be a better way to get the orders started before they get to the window. Yeah. Uh, which was extremely, I think, I think it was... A, not just innovative, but uh, very, um, he kept the flow. He kept the flow and very forward thinking. Like the little uh, washing machine out there was not used to wash our aprons or clothes. It was oh. used to spin out the water out of the diced potatoes before being fried. Wow, so yeah, we were saying another what they use this for. Another, another way to reuse a 1948 washer. Now, is this functional right now or no? No, nothing. nothing's plugged in for safety just okay. because we wouldn't want the grills on. But we do have electricity in here. Nothing is plugged in. Uh-huh. Yeah. So let's talk and listen. <laughs> we can get that burger started. All right. This so. is a, a cheese slicer. So a block of cheese would go in right here. The handle would turn and then the wire slices it. Wow. And then you can see the original a potato dicer, or it could be an onion dicer as well. Hi, how are you, sir? That's an original. And then you all remember the old timey. Yeah. Things. I wish I wouldn't have thrown away my mom's. <laughs> my mom's was rusted, and I thought, oh, I shouldn't keep that right when I put it down. Hi, guys. How are you? Good, good things. How are you? Where do you guys come from? Are you guys from around the area? Or? Oh, you guys are. 
So here's the Coke bottles. That's a nice Are you The wraps to keep it clean, keep the floor clean. The fries. And here you are your burgers, your cheese, lettuce and tomatoes. And there's your salt salt shakers. Uh, so quick little tour inside with the original in and out look like. So alright. Alright. I'm gonna pick up my order. So here's your double double, your fries, and your hot chocolate. Alright, thank you. Thank you for coming to In and Out. So here's the In and Out sign that uh, Lydia was talking about with the uh the clock then you have the original uh the replica of the original which lydia was saying that it was across the street originally so now they have it on this side and wow that was a treat thank you lydia shout out to her for for doing that for us and yes that is the replica of the original in and out and they're from thursday through Sunday from 11 to 2 o'clock. So if you want to come out here, like I said, Garvey and Francisquito in uh, Baldwin Park, you can definitely come check it out. All right, now that we visited the museum, I think it's time to go get lunch. Me too. Where do you think we're gonna go? Yeah, in and out, <laughs> let's go. We just visited the In-N-Out Museum. Now we drove over just about a, under the freeway, about a block, and we're out here to have a classic double-double, a classic cheeseburger with some pickles, the classic fries, and a Neapolitan shake. So we sure hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel. It sure helps us out. And we'll see you next time on today's walk. Bye.